Finally, it's over to Queenstown Stadium, where the Tanjung Paga Jaguars entertain a determined Gombak United side. All the action was in the second half. The Jaguars having a better start to the game after the break. This budget Motla corner, only half cleared by keeper Goho Tong. And Basri Halis' header looked to be heading in, if not for the ever alert Mohamed Shak Ban Porn. But it was the visitors who found the net first in the 62nd minute. A poor clearance by the Jaguars' backline, and Thai import Jay Surachai was on hand to punish them. His floating cross finding the head of skipper Jorgen Nielsen. But it was all square. Barely six minutes later, the Bulls finding it hard to check Basri Hollis. His cross finding an unmarked Abdul Mafavi, who rounded the keeper to touch on the equalizer. Gombach should have regained the lead two minutes later, but Lady Luck was not on their side as this glancing header by To Chun Meng beat Dragon Talayic, but not the upright. And the Bulls were severely punished for that miss. A bit of magic by Majid Motla on the left flank. The former Iranian international beat two defenders and provided a pinpoint cross for substitute Stephen Tan to head home from five meters. Stephen Tan almost returned the favor in the dying minutes of the game. His perfect cross picking out Majid Motla, who just could not connect cleanly with his head. But Tanjong Paga still ran out winners 2-1 to the Jaguars. And we take a look at all the scores once again. On to the league standings, and this is how the table looks after round 10. Singapore Armed Forces have taken the lead for the first time this season on 21 points after their demolition of the Rams. But the Jaguars and the Eagles are hot on their heels. Tanjung Paga and Geelong both on 20 points following their narrow wins. Home United dropped to fourth, but are only two points off the pace. And Jurong's win over the Protectors keep them within striking distance of the leading pack. The Cobras now on 17 points. The only change at the bottom half of the table, Tampanese Rovers climb above Woodlands Wellington after 